Hey guys, so today I'm going to be filling some requests and one person requested on one of my recent videos that they wanted me to do a review um, of the U by Kotex Barely There liner, so that's exactly what I'm going to do today. So just to start off with, um, as you may or may not know, the U by Kotex Barely There liners come in these really cute packaging and there's three of them. Uh, there are different kinds, but I just have three to show you guys. And if you're wondering why it's on blue, it's for the contrast of the white pad, because my table is white, as you can see. And I'm sorry if you see my shadow. I can't really help that. So, yeah. For this video, I'm just going to be using this blue one. And we're just going to be unwrapping it. And it does make quite a bit of noise if that's one of your concerns. So. When you peel it off, this part stays to the plastic. And um, what you get off is the actual pad, and it's kind of transparent on the sides, and then the middle is the absorbent part, so we're just going to stick it right here, my sticking skills, and I just have some crystal light in a cup to be <laughs> measuring how much it can absorb, um, so it's going to be an absorbency test and review, so, and in this medicine cup I have one teaspoon, and since people normally bleed in one spot, we're just going to be pouring it in one spot. So. so I pour it on the middle and it spreads out even to the transparent part. But I doubt you would want it to spread to the <laughs> transparent part if you're wearing it. So I keep pouring it in the center, but it keeps just spreading out. And there's the last of it. But as you can see, it's kind of holding on right there and but it keeps moving off outward and I think that's all I'm going to be putting on it because it looks like it can't hold anymore so that's exactly one um teaspoon and I think if I press down on it oh I didn't even press down on it and you can kind of tell that there's loose liquid at the top so but if I do press down on it then it's quite a lot and off. It's not dripping or anything, so I would say it holds about one teaspoon or less. You would most likely want it to hold less than one teaspoon, so that's why it is a liner, but yeah. I feel like this is great for tampon backup or um, just on an everyday basis if that's kind of your problem with discharge or something like that. So yeah. And I have worn this liner before, and I would give it a 5 out of 5 stars, because I really like it. And, um, yeah, it doesn't hold that much liquid, but it's great for being a liner. So, yeah, 